Hello everyone, this is Hero here and welcome to another King of Fighters 98 Auto Match Online video. Okay, today's video is just to do a short run through of what are the events currently happen in the Asia server right now. Okay, you can take this as a part one video. Okay, because I'll be doing the Fortune Cat event on the last day, which is on the third day. To show you guys uh, how much diamonds I will get from the fortune cat Because I'm waiting for this carnival on the, for the third day to happen Okay, I'll explain further later Okay, let's just look at the events Okay, so I mentioned before You have a chance to have boss clone battle event Okay, so this time we have it Which is for Orochi Leona Okay Team battle to get Orochi Leona fragments. Okay, so for this, if you manage to beat the clone battle three times, you get this rewards plus one Orochi Leona frag. Okay, so the next event, International Fashion Week. Basically, you buy costumes for certain characters. Okay, for this time, they featuring quite a few characters. Okay, Kula. Which heart is actually for Athena? Mine Mine does this Sakura fashion which is uh, She wearing a kimono And Rugal fashion And lastly Orochi Chris fashion Okay just to show you guys a quick one on how the fashion looks like Okay for Rugal this is the one you are looking at Okay For Orochi Chris is this Okay, actually they are quite nice, I like them, but I do not have enough diamonds to actually buy them all Okay, mine Okay And Anthena, this is very nice actually Which heart is very nice Okay So let's go back to the event Okay, before that, uh, just to... Sorry may I ask, are costumes worth buying, especially to spend so much diamond to buy? Okay, diamond uh, normally when you buy the fashion is actually a permanent thing, which means that you buy the fashion it stays with you permanently. Okay, for gold you buy it will stay with you for seven days only. Okay, so is it worth it? Basically, it, it all boils down to if you like it or not. Okay, if for example, Antina, I like her fashion a lot. She looks very cute in the witch hat, the witch outfit. So. I may buy, okay, I'm not confirmed yet, not sure when I'm buying yet, but it, this is just purely based on your liking, if you like it very much, you just buy it, okay, so there's nothing much, I uh, can't really say whether it's worth it or not, okay, but the price may drop in the future, okay, it will drop in the future, let's say now Rugal Fashion is cost 3,088 diamonds, in the future it will drop, okay, when more fashion has been released then this is like considered old fashion then they will drop the price okay so let's look at the next event okay i mentioned before okay boss limited boss event okay when they release normally it also comes with either of these two events okay one recharge diamonds event second one spend diamonds event okay this time for zero limited draw, the developers have give us diamond recharge event. Recharge X amount of diamond, you get rewards. Okay, so we can see all these rewards: sixty diamonds, six hundred, one thousand. So these are all actually quite standard rewards. Okay, when you hit four thousand, you can get any of these boxes. Five frags. Okay, let's say you choose zero, you get five frags. Of zero fragments, okay. For six thousand, nine thousand, quite standard. Okay, mainly you get awakening gems. At twelve thousand, you get ten frags of these bosses. Okay, either one of these bosses, ten frags. Sixteen thousand up to twenty thousand. Twenty thousand, you get twenty frags. Okay, twenty frags is quite a lot. Okay, and lastly twenty five thousand. Okay, so if you're going for zero frags, 
you can potentially get up to 35 frags here if you recharge out to 20,000 diamonds, okay? 20 here, 10, and 5. 35 zero fragments is actually a lot, okay, to get here. Plus, you get diamonds also. So, it's actually quite a worth it event, okay? So, lastly, it's also, it's of course, the zero defense wall. I've already done this. I've got two frags from this. Okay, so let's look at Carnival. Okay, Carnival, I'm sure most of you guys are quite familiar with it. When the server just opened, especially for the global server, you guys did this Carnival event to get Q fragments, okay? For this, our ultimate reward is 500 Awakened Fragment, okay? But most probably won't be, won't be able to get 500, maybe lesser than that. 300? Or 400 around there okay so this is just the first day so basically we have lock in a uh, quest challenge main campaign quest okay the last one is 1000 challenge elite campaign okay actually friendly speaking the elite campaign rewards are much better than the main campaign rewards and this is like 1000 times actually very high may not be able to complete 1000 times unless every day you buy a lot of SP okay and the rewards only up to 120 diamonds only compared to Awakened Fragments is quite less Awakened Fragments are more worth it okay so I okay I mentioned last time why I'm going to do the fortune cap on the third day okay the third day is the last day of the fortune cap okay and the boss event Okay, and the third day this will unlock there is a chance where this third day uh, mission quest will say recharge or gain X amount of diamonds okay or spend X amount of diamonds but cannot not really sure okay so I'm gonna wait until the last day before I decide that's why I'm not gonna recharge yet for this event, I'm going to wait on the third day. Then we are recharged, then I'll do the fortune cat. Okay? So this is why I'm stopping, uh, not doing fortune cat at the moment, until the third day. But of course, I'll be doing a video for this. Okay, so let's look at the time limited chest. Zero. Okay, this time, zero is released. Okay? So you guys can see, currently this is just the first day only. The top points is 4,610 points. Okay, there's a chance on the last day, I'm not sure, maybe it will hit above 10,000 points. Okay, so these are all the standings you guys can see. Okay. So for this zero e e event, it's limited equipment chest okay actually we prefer to be it to be equipment chest rather than asteroid chest because asteroid chest when you open you only get asteroid stones and some other random rewards equipment chest you get awakening gems you have a chance to get power fragment chest and you get back diamonds also okay from 88 diamonds up to 588 diamonds okay so this is actually a better draw compared to Asteroid Chest. Okay. So this is it for today's video. This is a very short video to go through the event. Okay, on the third day, okay, I will do a fortune cat and also I will be doing the rest of the draws. Okay, for all these chests. Okay. I'm not going for zero. Okay. I'm just going for the 80 frags here. Okay. So, on the third day, I see you guys again. Okay. After uh, when I'm about to do the fortune cat. Okay. I'll do a video on this. Okay. So, I see you guys on the third day. Goodbye.